This is video shot earlier today by the space station and shuttle crews of uh, an experiment set up by the Space Shuttle Endeavor. Experiments called the Commercial Generic Bioprocessing Apparatus Science Insert, which is a long name for an experiment that you, allows. I don't know if you have uh, it up on the screen, but those were the butterfly larvae. We have it on the screen, and for some reason we got mixed reaction when you said butterfly larvae. As I was saying, that program is an educational and science program designed to interest students ages. I'm not sure if you can uh, see this video or not, even though it's probably going through some of your assets. I uh, just wanted to let you know that we're uh, really proud of working with this experiment and uh, really glad to uh, share it with you all. And Mike, we've got a uh, great video here as well. We're seeing it. This video shot earlier today of flight engineer Sandy Magnus and space station commander Mike Fink working on a experiment designed to interest students ages K through 12 in science, technology, engineering, and math. This particular part of the experiment involves sending spiders and butterflies up to the International Space Station. And students will be able to see the complete life cycle of a painted lady butterfly, or rather several, from egg to butterfly. The crew earlier showed you a shot of the butterfly larvae that the shuttle has brought up. And the students will be able to compare how the life cycle of that the butterflies differs in space compared to butterflies on the Earth. The shuttle also brought up an orb weaving spider that will be living in space so that the students can compare how that spider differs in behavior from the spiders they find on the Earth. This is experiment was just part of about 1,500 pounds of... We are about to increase the airlock CCAA band speed. Station copies. This experiment was part of about 1,500 pounds of supplies and equipment and science experiments brought up on the mid-deck of Space Shuttle Endeavor. That's in addition to the more than 14,000 pounds of supplies and equipment brought up inside of the multi-purpose logistics module that was opened up today.
a bit difficult to see with the reflection, but this is the box that the orb weaving spider is living in while it's staying on the International Space Station. Students involved in the experiment can participate in the classroom in near real time, or teachers can use it just about any time they want to. Again, the experiment allows students con to compare the behavior of the spiders and butterflies with in microgravity with their earthbound counterparts. Houston Station 2, I think we uh coming up on a on an LOS or a small handover. Um happy to pause the video at your call. And uh, sorry, I thought this one was going to be a little bit shorter. Time just went by.